An average person can't invest in commercial real estate, right? It's only for the ultra rich. It's not something that just a normal person can do. Wrong. In this video, we're gonna talk about a just a basic case study, someone that I knew uh, that didn't think he was able to buy commercial real estate. And once we ran through all the numbers, he realized that he could. So we're gonna talk about my friend, his name is Bob. Bob has a auto repair business. Um, he's done really well, he's been at it for 10 years, he's got you know, great reviews online, his clients love him. Um, you know, he's doing quite well, um, but he's leasing. You know, he's, he's paying rent to somebody else and he took a step back and realized that, ah, you know, I think I'm paying rent to someone and making their life better and not really getting very much out of it myself. Um, and, you know, sometimes you have to agree. Uh, he and I took a step back and we looked at the numbers of, you know, is there something out there that he could buy that would be a similar monthly expense to renting? And does that make sense? Is there enough upside for him to make that kind of leap from being a tenant to being a landlord. And so we looked around the market and we were able to find a small standalone warehouse um, that had the right zoning and, you know, was the right location. Of course, it was a little bit beat up, you know, it needed some paint, it needed uh, some work on the inside, the roof was a little leaky. Um, you know, there was definitely some things to it. It wasn't just a simple, you know, uh, sign the purchase and sale agreement and move in kind of situation. Uh, but we found a property that he knew could work. We had contractors bid, you know, what we were going to need to get it up to speed. And we looked at those numbers and we compared it against the rent that he had been paying. And we realized that this made sense, that he could own his own commercial real estate for a very similar monthly expense to what he rented. So he went for it. He bought the property, he fixed it up, and now he is a proud commercial real estate owner. Uh, you know, when we started the process, he was very skeptical. He's like, I, I don't know that I have the resources to do this. Um, and I think what helped a lot was access to SBA loans. SBA loans are 10% down for people that are owner users. If you occupy 51% or more of the building, it basically allows you to buy commercial real estate for 10% down, which is something almost no one else can do. It gives you an inherent advantage. So, you know, even though the warehouse was $700,000, seems like a lot of money, he only needed 10% down, which was $70,000 a lot more achievable. Um, you know, he was able to look at that $70,000 and he had, you know, saved some money to basically do the repairs. You know, he also had some, some friends and family member that were in the trades that could kind of help him with that. And so he ended up being able to buy this, put another $50,000 in fixing it up. And now he has like new commercial real estate and he is the owner. He's not paying rent to anybody. He's paying rent to himself. There are so many benefits that go into owning commercial real estate. So just wanted to share this story as an example of someone who didn't think he could afford commercial real estate and ended up buying his own space. Now he owns his own commercial real estate and he is, you know, paying down his loan every month. He's got an asset that is going to be valuable to his family. I mean, imagine 25 years from now, imagine if you had a 100% paid off piece of commercial real estate. Wouldn't that be better than just paying 25 years of rent to make somebody else rich? These are the sort of things you should be asking yourself, especially if you're a business owner paying rent. Ask yourself, why am I not my own landlord? Uh, it's much more easy to do than you think. Um, it does take some work, it does take some research, and you wanna have the right team. So definitely reach out to a commercial real estate broker. If you ever need help, I'm Dave with Carlson O'Connell Commercial Real Estate. I would be happy to talk through the preliminary numbers with you. Um, if you got any value out of this video, please hit subscribe. I greatly appreciate it. Uh, thank you so much for tuning in, and we'll see you next week.